this place is kind of different. Something's up. Organization 13? Oh, yeah, oh, yes. Only one way to find out. Aztec treasury! Aye, and thanks to the curse put on it, we are neither among the living nor the dead. Really? Cause you look like regular pirates to me. Ah. <sighs> But in the moonlight... Whoa! Now I get what you were saying. Hmm... Well, if you see two doofuses and a brat holding a keyblade, steer clear. They got a kind of magic that don't belong in this world, see? And nobody knows what it'll do to you. Especially when the moon's showing what you really are. A match for Barbosa, you say? Hey! See there? I knew it. <laughs> Those are the punks I was telling you about. Who are you calling punks? It's Sora, Donald, and Goofy to you, and don't you forget it. That we won't, and we'll engrave it on your tombstone, to be sure. Whoa, I like your style. Man, half of you stay here and indulge these cullies. The rest, bring me that medallion. Aye! Aw, oh, we only get to stomp on a few of you? <laughs> It's no use. We can't beat them. I what do you expect? <laughs> you best be saying your prayers. Hey, watch out! They could see you! Stay away from their magic! What for? Weren't you listening to me before? Hey, Pete, thanks for the tip. <laughs> Where are you taking me? Let me go! Ugh. 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 Elizabeth! Stop! What are they? It's the Rattlers! Watch out! We'll deal with them. Go! Take cover! Uh, we're too late! Huh? Those pirates kidnapped Miss Swan and took her to their ship. Now they've sailed. And I'll never be able to find her. Then she's long gone. The Black Pearl is nigh uncatchable. Best find yourself another girl, mate. You! What are you doing aboard the Interceptor? She's off limits to civilians. Ah, fortunate that I'm going to commandeer her then. She'll make a fine pirate ship. A pirate? Captain Jack Sparrow, if you please. Take me with you. Help me hunt down the Black Pearl and save Miss Swan. I got you out of that jail cell, Sparrow. Do this, and your debt's repaid. You'll have to win Fair Lady's Heart alone, mate. I see no profit in it for me. Come on, Captain. Are you sure you can sail her? All on your own? You've a point there. Thanks, Sparrow. Captain Sparrow. I'm Sora. This is Donald and Goofy. I'm Will Turner. That will be short for William, I imagine. No doubt name for your father, eh? Yes. Well then, Mr. Turner, you get us ready to make way. I have some effects to liberate. Aye, aye. But hurry. Naturally. Sora. You really want to be a pirate? Of course not. What do you make of this will? I don't know. We just met him. Uh, I think my luck's about to change. You can release
kiss me. You have your trinket. I'm of no further value to you. This is no trinket, Missy. This is cursed Aztec gold. One of 882 identical pieces they delivered in a stone chest to Cortez himself. I hardly believe in ghost stories anymore, Captain Barbosa. That's exactly what I thought. Buried on an island of dead, what cannot be found except for those who know where it is. Find it, we did. There be the chest. Inside be the gold. And we took them all. We spent them and traded them and fritted them away on drink and food and pleasurable company. The more we gave them away, the more we came to realize the drink would not satisfy, and food turned to ash in our mouths. We are cursed men, Miss Turner. Compelled by greed we were, but now we are consumed by it. How very sad for you. <laughs> there is one way we can end our curse. All the scattered pieces of the Aztec gold must be gathered and restored to the stone chest and the blood of every soul who touched a piece of the treasure must be repaid. Miss Turner, for ten years we've searched every league of these waters, every town and village, preying on sailors and settlers alike. 881 pieces we found, but despaired of ever finding the last. All those years, you've been safe in your bed, Reading your pirate stories, dreaming of adventures in the high seas, we've endured torments worse than death itself. But now, thanks to ye, we have the final peace at last. When this medallion is restored to the chest, we'll be free to roam the seas as men. No longer will we be ghosts. And the blood that's to be repaid? That's why there's no sense to be killing you. Yet. <gasps> you see, the moonlight shows us for what we really are. We're not among the living. And so we cannot die. But... Neither are we dead. I've suffered too long. You'd best start believing in ghost stories, Miss Turner. For you see, tonight, you're in one. <laughs> peace that went astray, we have returned, save for this. And now, the blood will be repaid to free us from this curse forever. No, not yet. We wait for the opportune moment. When it's of greatest profit to you? May I ask you something? Have I ever given you reason not to trust me? Stay here. And try not to do anything stupid. <gasps> Begone by blood, by blood undone.
You! Mate! Your father! Was your father William Turner? No. I don't understand! What's going on? Who brought this wench to yeah. us? She what said her name about? was Turner! Come on! Why isn't it working? You need more blood! Get on hey, with idiots. it! Hurry! You there! The medallion! After them, you ingrates! Quick, they're after us! We'll hold them off. Give us a sign when the ship's ready to sail. Right. We'll light the signal fire. The signal! Is it true? You gave Barbosa my name instead of yours. Why choose my name? I don't know. Elizabeth, where did you get that? It's yours. From that day we found you. Drifting at sea. After all this time, I thought I lost it. It was a gift from my father. He sent it to me. I'm sorry. Why did you take it? Because I was afraid that you were a pirate. That would have been awful. Of course. Don't you see? It wasn't your blood they needed. It was my father's blood. My blood. The blood. Of a pirate. How the blazes did you get off that island, Jack? When you sailed away in my ship and marooned me on that godforsaken spit of land with naught but a pistol and a single shot, you forgot one very important thing, mate. I'm Captain Jack Sparrow. I won't be making that mistake again. Then what say you to putting the past behind us, untying these ropes, and letting me negotiate the return of your medallion, eh? What say you to that? Seeing as how the Black Pearl's mine now, Jack, letting you go doesn't seem to fall within my interest. Odd. I'm not actually concerned with your interest. Give me back the pearl! Arr. All right. Lock him in the brig. We're coming up on the interceptor. What do we do, Captain? What do you think, you idiot? Will, look! What now? I wonder what Jack would do. I'm not sure. I suppose he'd run for it. Sounds good to me! <laughs> uh, wow! Uh, Will! Everyone hit the deck! Uh. We're just gonna have to fight! The pirates! Well, did you know? <gasps> Jack! <laughs> now then, I'll be having back that medallion. Unless it's more important than their lives. Barbosa! She goes free! Go ahead, boy, shoot! We can't die. You can't. <sighs> but I can. My name is Will Turner. My father was bootstrapped Bill Turner. His blood runs in my veins. Aye? On my word, do as I say, or I'll pull this trigger and be lost to Davy Jones' locker. Name your terms. 
Mr. Turner. Release Elizabeth. And Sora. And Donald. And Goofy too. Anything else? Leave. Now! Agreed. Leave we shall. But the Heartless stay. <laughs> No fair! All clear. That's the second time I've had to watch that man sail away with my ship. But I'll be having her back soon enough. Now, let's be joined us again. The last of the Aztec treasure has been returned. And now, the blood will be repaid to free us from this curse forever! This time for sure! Yeah! <laughs> Ahoy! Treasure, mateys! Not possible. Well, probably. We were young and well pirates. Captain Jack Sparrow. Sora. Captain Jack! Goofy, too! So you wanna play pirate? Best save the play acting for the nursery. After them! <laughs> No more play acting now. Thank you, Sora. Oh, where's Jack? Jack, get him. Uh, huh? Uh. <gasps> Jack, you're a fool, Jack Sparrow. Jack. Show yourself, Pete! The tide has changed! See? I told you you'd be needing old Pete! This ain't over! Right. Care to surrender, Barbosa? Well, enough of this then. What say you we call it a draw? Jack, how many times do I have to tell you? <laughs> Laugh while you can, Barbosa. I feel cold. What now, Jack? Whatever I want, now that the Pearl is mine again. That she is. Thank you, Jack. I didn't want you hitting me again, mate. Hey, Jack. Good luck. I remember to be good! I'm off. Good for them. Oh, uh -huh. hey, Sora. 
How come your face is all red? What? It is not red. Ah, uh, I know who you're thinking about. No. For a minute there, I was afraid we were gonna lose Donald to the curse of the treasure. Yup, me too. What? Jack! Uh, Zola, some assistance? That's Sora, Donald, and Goofy. Will you leave a mate to perish? Aye, aye. Interceptor off the starboard bow! Woo! Stop that, Jack! We've got to rescue him! Medallions and the stone chest. Someone's taken them. Next thing I knew, we were attacked. But I couldn't see who it was. His face was shrouded in a black hood. The organization. We found a way out of the cave. But the villain sent a horde of terrible creatures after us. I've never seen their likes before. I think. I'm the only one who made it back to the ship. Will. Elizabeth. I feel rather... Uh... Our turn, guys. You'd best go prepared. We've no idea what's out there. Pardon me, lads and lass. But your captain will have no monsters today. Thank you. We're turning for home. Just like that? Just like that. Don't remember inviting you. So it was the organization. We'll handle this. Huh? The darkness of men's hearts, drawn to these cursed medallions, and this heartless, a veritable maelstrom of avarice. I wonder, are they worthy to serve Organization 13? And you want an answer now? Precisely. Oh boy! Not over yet. Throw him overboard. Aye, aye. Holly! Excuse me? Barley? It's a bit of a pirate's code. Anyone who invokes parley must not be harmed till negotiations are complete. This is no time for rules. True. But as we're honorable pirates, we should always stick to the code. All right, you. Out with it. I surrender the chest with my humblest apologies. Rather accommodating of you, mate. And for that you want... Just a few souvenirs. For the memories. Huh? Oh no! We can't stop the 
verse unless we got all the medallions. Our friend's about to learn what it means to cross a pirate. Oh. Sora, Donald, Goofy, he's yours. <laughs> you stole a medallion again? Were I only that fortunate? Fortunate? So, uh, how come you're all skeleton-y? Perhaps I got a touch of something from that monster what attacked us. Yet, why is the skin resting right on you three? Cause we're not greedy! What do you get to that? That still doesn't solve the mystery. Gorge! Maybe the reason we're all okay is because we're not from this world! There must be different laws. Yeah. We're always just passing through. Wonder when we'll see home again. Sure. <laughs> just kidding you. Lucky we didn't get cursed, huh? Quit yammering, mates. We've got to find ourselves a ship that'll float. Three more to go. How do you know? A pirate must have a keen eye, else he won't be sailing free for very long. Sevy? What? What's that? Ahoy, mateys! Ridiculous imitation, and yet, I'm flattered. That's four medallions. We got them all. But where's the chest? If we find the hooded man, we'll find it. Probably in Port Royal. Why's that? Organization 13 is after people's hearts, so they're gonna go wherever there's lots of people. They'll hurt the townsfolk? No, they're bringing them flowers, mate. I don't know who these organizers are, but I will say they're making we pirates look like proper gents. Well, Jack, then we have to help. Then let go and hold a run free. Now to break that curse. The curse! It's gone! Then what's this? Oh, I understand. Jack must have been cursed by that monster, not from taking the gold. Oh, I've no worries then. It's okay, Jack. We'll just have to defeat the monster, that's all. Get the gold! All better. And not quite, mate. Sora! Bravo! 
Just who was that chap? He is part of an organization that's collecting hearts. First, they release heartless into different worlds. We defeat those heartless, then they get the hearts. We're never going to stop them like this. What's the plan then? We got to find their stronghold and finish them off once and for all. Sail in these waters, I've heard some tales, but not a one like this. Is there any way we can help? Hmm. Anything at all. There is. It's certain we don't need the likes of that hooded fellow and the heartless about. They'll ruin the market for us true pirates. So that's why you went to Port Royal. And we thought you actually wanted to save everyone. A pirate always looks to profit, Miss Swan. Too bad. You had us going there thinking you'd turned over a new leaf. The question is, what's beyond the leaf, Savvy? Oh, oh yes. A reward. And what'll it be? That lovely blade of Sora's. Huh? <laughs> okay, sure. Hold on, that was far too easy. Uh, what's the rub? Ah, oh, there you see. Well, you've always got the pearl, Jack. That I do. But someday I'll gather a bloodthirsty crew and come to take that blade. Chance by then, I'll have the way to wield it. And if I succeed, I'll ask you two to join me. That'd be reward enough. Done. Maybe someday Jack will be able to use the Keyblade after all. Where's that? <laughs> yep. He and Sora are kind of alike, don't you think? Or not? <laughs> Some say Jack Sparrow's the worst pirate ever to sail the Spanish main. No one could really mean that. Right. We know he's the best. I hope we'll get to see him again. It's life for me. <laughs> Why are you so happy? Cause we get to be pirates again. Yep, you always did like this world. How could anyone not? Still, it's a real shame we don't have a bigger ship. Where else? The edge of the world! Captain Sora! Oh? What ails ya, Mr. Goofy? The edge of the world! Aye! We're running out of sea, sir! Aye! We're running out of sea! <laughs> oh? Running out?!
End up this time. We've been walking forever. I'm exhausted. Some pirates. We won't get anywhere without a ship. Hmm. A ship. This is dry land! Oh boy! It, it is, is a ship! Sora? Huh? Oh, Jack Sparrow! <sighs> Captain Jack Sparrow. Sure is. <laughs> hey, Jack, where are we? Oh. Belay that ship absconding! Huh? Help me catch the pearl before she gets away! <laughs> aye aye, Captain. Hey, Captain. I thought so. I expect you're able to account for your actions then. Sir? There's been a perpetual and virulent lack of discipline upon my vessel. Why? Sir, you're... You're in Davy Jones' locker, Captain. Hmm? Davy Jones' locker? I know that. I know where I am. And don't think I don't. I'm in Davy Jones' locker. Assuredly. Oh, Jack Sparrow. <gasps> Barbosa! Oh. Ah, Hector! It's been too long, hasn't it? Aye, Illa de Muerta, remember? You shot me. Hm? Uh, no, I didn't. Sora, we meet again. Huh? It's lovely to see you all. Oh, Will! Elizabeth! Is... something about you different? Yeah, you look all swashbuckly. Well, I've seen some adventures. But I never thought I'd find you here. Speaking of, where exactly is here? What's all this about a locker? Davy Jones' locker. Jack neglected to repay a certain debt to Jones. So Joan sent the Kraken to devour Jack. And that's how he ended up here. Uh. Then... Davy Jones' locker... You're saying that we've gone beyond... Beyond the grave? Yeah. 
Mm. And we're here to rest Jack from his fate. Hmm? See you at all, Ma. Out and about, eh? You had an agreeable sense of the macabre to any delirium. <laughs> he thinks we're a hallucination. <laughs> Complete with these three masqueraders. <sighs> Jack, this is real. We're here. We've come to rescue you. Huh? Have you now? That's very kind of you. But it would seem that as I possess a ship and you don't, you're the ones in need of rescuing. And I'm not sure as I'm in the mood. Jack! Cutler Beckett has the heart of Davy Jones. He controls the Flying Dutchman. He's taking over the seas. And he must be stopped. The Brethren caught his cald. Leave you people alone for just a minute and look what happens. Everything's gone to pot. Hmm? I'm lost. What's going on? Well, um... Sounds to me like this Beckett fella they mentioned is trying to conquer the ocean. Oh. That seems like that's to everyone. Yeah. No conquerors. Yeah. Listen, Jack. The world needs your back something fierce. And you need a crew. Why should I sail with any of you? Four of you have tried to annihilate me. Jack, we're on your side. Uh, so you are, mates. I never could have caught the pill without you. Sora, Donald, Goofy, you're hired. Yes! Now, as for the rest of you... Mm. <laughs> <laughs> Teodolma, you're in. Gibbs, you can come. Hey, <laughs> hey. Play anchor, all hands! Prepare to make sail! Jack. Which way you going, Jack? <laughs> right then! Mr. Sora, the helm is yours, provided no. you oh. pass muster. Huh? See that island there, with the two peaks? Prove you can reach that, and the open sea is yours. Oh! <laughs> aye, aye! So, we do have a destination, right? Oh, I can't tell anymore. Jack is just making it up. Hmm. 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 <laughs> Cast your fate with Jack Sparrow. And you'll soon be sharing in the wrath of David Jones. The guy Will mentioned? Who does he think he is, anyway? And what did Jack ever do to him? Truly. You don't know who David Jones be. And you say you be men of the sea. D um... Let's put it this way. We're from another sea. Hmm... Are you now? Jack and David Jones' fate be intertwined. Jones, him raise Jack's precious pearl from the depths and make Jack captain for 13 years. In exchange, Jack promised to give Jones him soul as payment. But 13 years pass. And Jack failed to return. So Jones, him seen the Kraken to devour Jack, taking him and the Pearl back to the depths. But if Jones learn that witty Jack cheat that fate, him wanna punish Jack even worse. And Jack's friends too. <laughs> Are you uh, talking about us? You mean that the Kraken's gonna eat us? Stop! Let the Kraken have a crack. I ain't scared. 
Hmm. Not scared at all. That be rare. Most men, them run for land at the mention of the Kraken. Not you. But Jack be scared. He want to be free of his debt to Davy Jones. That's why he need the box. Box? Oh, it be a chest where Davy Jones lock away the part of him that hurt. The pain it caused him was too much to live with, but not enough to cause him to die. Oh. And what part of him is that? <laughs> him hard. How does he do it? A creature absent a heart, and yet somehow able to keep existing. Not even my finest replica can claim that achievement. The secret must be in that box. I have to know what mysteries it contains. I believe our orders were to find the box and seize it. No more. Put a leash on that runaway curiosity. Always so short-sighted. Why would the organization seek me out just as soon as I was re-completed, if not to affirm my intellectual prowess and invest in my research? Every stride I make is a stride for all of us. Oh, really? And what exactly are we striding towards? Hmm? Luxord. Do I detect a hint of treachery in your words? What? Don't be absurd. But to be clear, I serve the organization. I don't share your need to please Xemnas. He's good at wrapping you around his little finger. Always has been. Hmm. All I desire is the freedom to continue my research. Ansem the Wise refused to nurture my talents, so I cast my lot with Xemnas. With Xehanort, rather. Simple as that. I see. And you don't care how he uses your research? Not in the slightest. All that concerns me is that I complete the perfect human vessel. Mm-hmm. <laughs> That's all well and good, but I know this world better than you. Kindly stay out of the way. Oh, of course. Considering those pests have shown up, I'd hardly get anything done. I already know what to do with the pests. Then you can resume your stuffy studies. Huh. That's my boy. I'll be watching from the shadows, then. Jack, you could have warned us. Yeah, everything went topsy turvy and upsy downsy. Well, at least we're back in the land of the living. Never fear, all according to plan. But that be no reason to rest easy. Huh? A ship. I've never seen one like that. Heartless! Oh, 
Master! Have you aligned with those fiends again? Don't impugn me, Honor. Why would I conspire with them? But you did conspire with them. Could you discuss it later? Oh. Huh? <laughs> Hmm. I sure do wish we could get a little closer. What? What are there? We can't do that. <gasps> we can! Zora! <laughs> Donald and Goofy! Protect the ship! I'll handle the Heartless! Take this! All right! Huh? Wait! Oh no! Sorry, Sora. Sora! <laughs> Donald? Goofy? <sighs> Where are the others? After you fell, we came looking for you. I guess they must have kept going. Thanks, that's awesome. Oh. And I was so happy that we got to see them again. That's eager to sail under Captain Jack Sparrow. Oh? Jack! Perhaps you'll consider an arrangement. One which requires nothing from you but information. Regarding the Brethren Court, no doubt. In exchange for fair compensation, square my debt with giants, guarantee my freedom. Of course. It's just good business. Were I in a divulgatory mood, what then might I divulge? Everything. Where are they meeting? What are their plans? Shall we? Shall we what? Some pirate won't get anywhere without a ship. <whistles> So, let's go get one. Oh, <laughs> yes! <laughs> Sora and Jack sure are cut from the same cloth. Use that key to free me, Sora, and you have my most certain promise. And the power and the sea you ever wish for be yours. Free her... how? What's wrong? Huh? Oh, nothing really. I'm good. Ship! 
<laughs> you certain about that? Huh? What? Jack? Find us, keep us. How'd he get here so fast? Mine. Sammy? Now, Sammy! Jack, you already have the Black Pearl. Aye, uh, to which this ship holds no candle. <laughs> Bus, take what you can, mate. Now then, my ship has a captain, but it does appear I'm in need of a crew. Suppose you'll have to do. Don't dawdle. I'm aboard. Um... Ready now, helmsman? Ready enough, Captain, but aren't we kind of trapped? Mm -hmm. Now, Sora. I know you've made passage through straits far more dire than this. Just follow your heart's command. <sighs> hmm. That ship! It's the Hedris! Oh, but look! This time there's somebody aboard! Isn't that... Not the merry company I'd hoped for. Harley! A black coat! Of course. You back in the organization? Yes. Surprising, isn't it, that they do me the honor? Never count your cards until they've all been dealt. Jack, don't you give this creep the time of day. <laughs> Come now. Are you really so unsophisticated that you decline a gentlemanly conversation? What'd you say? Sora, uh stand down. It's the code. Mustn't strike a pirate aboard ship. When said pirate offers to confabulate. Ah, yes. And how could I love games and contests without honoring the rules? Because only by winning fairly does victory have any savor at all. But, of course, the code is actually more guidelines than rules. Speak your piece. Hmm. I am looking for a box. A chest, perhaps. Mm. You know the one. Yes. <clears throat> Mary! No, I know of a box. But said box is not a box you want to trifle with, mate. Trust me. Really? A wager, then. And of what nature would this wager be? What say we have a little race to that charming port town which you hold so dear? Port Royal. Yes. Whoever reaches it first is the victor. And the stakes? You tell me all about that chest. Against what? I will get you whatever it is you want. Hmm. Hmm. Done. Jack? Then we have an accord. Now. Let us begin! All hands! Prepare to make sail! But, Jack! Drop canvas! Hey! Jack! With a will, lads! Jack, listen! What? Oh! You can't let him get his hands on that box! 
Do you really know whatever it is that he's looking for? Let's just say there's a potential possibility he wants the chest containing Davy Jones' heart. Does I have the foggiest notion why he'd covet the blighted thing? Is it a black box? It is more black than blue, so yes. Hmm. Do you think it's the one? And when in the race would keep it out of Organization 13's hands? Hey. <laughs> You're right. What are you three muttering on about? Basically, we need to win this race. Precisely. No purchase, no pay. You might have the makings of a pirate after all. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Lookouts, report! Starboard side, all clear! We got this one in the bag. The game isn't over until it's over. Magnificent. I salute you all, gentlemen. Mm, you're up to something. I love it! Perish the thought. I know when I've been outdone. You were outdone before you even started, mate. But I admire your conciliatory way of conceding defeat. Ah. Yes. Now, I believe I owe you your prize, but I neglected to ask what it is that you want. Perhaps you'll enlighten me. <laughs> Aye, that's easy. I want the chest that's aboard the Dutchman. No, Jack! Don't tell him! Hmm? Really? Uh. Not good. Huh? Oh, Jack! Well, I didn't tell him which, Dutchman. You cracked him! Actually, I outwitted him. You knew he'd tell you where it was! <laughs> I've always been far more interested in the long game. Now let's see where it takes us. That is, if you stay apace. After him! Nay. There's no point. Why not? The ship's listing near to scuppers from that cannon fire. She'll be needing repairs. Best make berth at Port Royal. What? Look for crabs. They all set her right. Crabs? Why crabs? Never mind the particulars, mate. The white crabs. Savvy? Mm. Aye, aye.
Aye, that's all of them. Now, to my final task. Be back in a trice. Oh. There, mates. Fit to sail any sea. Now, Sora, one final inquiry. Is there any particular reason you wanted this ship? Mm. Mm. Yeah. To explore the seas. Free as the wind. Good answer. You are a pirate, Captain Sora. <laughs> but Jack, why do you keep saying final? Like you're leaving. Ah. It's because this me has run his course, mate. This you? Aye, the surrogate me, that the goddess of the sea sent here to help you lot. Of course, any me is still me. I may be duplicatable, but I'm always incomparable. The sea, she smiles upon us, Sora. Well, let's leave it at that, shall we? For now, the real me has a crucial engagement. At Shipwreck Cove, where the pirate brethren will meet Becca and his lot in battle to win back our freedom. Then let us help! No, it's for pirates to resolve, but not you, Sora. You're as free as the wind now, and far you'll go. Oh! Wow! <laughs> oh. So, Jack was showing us the way. Hey, what if you did get cracked? Jack, he said it was the pirates' battle to fight. <laughs> but a fight for pirates... <laughs> ...is a fight for us! Come on, let's find the real Jack. You made a deal with me, Jack, to deliver the pirates. And here they are. Don't be bashful. Step up. Claim your reward. <laughs> Sparrow! Your debt to me is still to be satisfied. One hundred years in servitude aboard the Dutchman. As a stop. That debt was paid, mate. You escaped! I propose an exchange. Hmm? Will leaves with us. And you can take Jack. Hmm? Hmm? Done. Undone. Done. Jack's one of the nine pirate lords. You have no right. King? Hmm. As you command, your nips. Scurvy blackguard! Uh. Uh, uh, uh. Easy there, mate. You wouldn't want to damage the leverage now, would you? Hmm. Now. <laughs> A 
advise your brethren. You can fight, and all of you will die, or you cannot fight, in which case only most of you will die. We will fight, and you will die. Are you okay? Sora... You're a welcome sight! We've all been quite worried about you. Huh? Isn't that... Sora? Where's Jack? And Tia Dalma? <sighs> I'm afraid you've missed a few things while you've been gone. Jack... He's... He's been taken by Cutler Beckett. Yes. And Beckett commands Davy Jones and the Flying Dutchman. Oh. Barbosa thought we could defeat them if we released Calypso, the goddess of the sea, who was really Teodalma, bound in human form. But it didn't work. I. A fickle goddess, Calypso B. So what now? Nothing. Our final hope has failed us. Use that key to free me, Sora. And you have my most certain promise. I'll the power under sea you ever wish for be yours. So... Tia Dalma was Calypso. She's the one who was helping us. And you know what? I think... that she might just be able to help us again. You can't give up now. We can all fight. Together. The sea belongs to everyone. Uh. Uh, uh. Hmm? I said that! Don't give me my expressions! Huh? You did? Sometimes it just goes in one ear and right out the other. Wait, really? Yes! It's not over. There's still hope for us. You will listen to me. Listen! The Brethren will still be looking here to us. To the Black Pearl to lead. And they will see free men and freedom! Our enemy will see the flash of our cannons and hear the ring of our swords and they will see the courage of our hearts as we succeed and they fail. Gentlemen, hoist the colors. Hoist the colors! Hoist the colors!
I knew it was you! So that's the Flying Dutchman. The chest Jack told you about has the heart of Davy Jones in it. There's no way it's the chest that you're looking for. <laughs> no one knows what's in the chest we're looking for. If it's a black box, then we are to collect it. Simple as that. You don't know what's in it? Then why do you need it? How will you know you found it? <laughs> Got me. Regrettably, the higher-ups haven't deigned to tell us. But they did say the box contains hope. Huh? huh. That's all you'll get from me. Hmm. It's far too chaotic to find the box like this. Perhaps I'll remove that ship from the picture. Others need us. Yeah, I know. So, you got what you want. Perhaps you're the better player among us. However, I must demand you give that to me. Cousin? You must be mistaken, mate. I'll not be giving you anything. <laughs> then I invoke the right of parley. No. Nope. No parley. Look around. We're a little busy. And besides, I've already got all that I want, mate. Still works. Giant spider. Are you lost? Prisoners don't belong on deck. Your station is in the brig! <laughs> We're here! Tables have turned, mate. Ah, boy. <laughs> Just a few more nuggets to join my crew! <laughs> Care to surrender? <sighs> the chest! Hand it over! Jack! <laughs> Stay out of this, boy! Whoa!
Mister, did you forget? Huh? I'm a heartless wretch. <laughs> <laughs> Ah, love, a dreadful bond, and yet, so easily said. That's not true. I may still have a lot to learn about love, but I know what it means to share my heart with others. And it will take more than you to break a bond like that. <laughs> what does a whelp? like you know about the heart. <laughs> a whelp has seen far more of the world than you know. <laughs> what of it? Tell me, William Turner. <laughs> Do you fear death? <laughs> Do you? How disappointing. So this is all they meant when they said heart. We've been chasing the wrong box this whole time. Peditonic. Holding life and death in the palm of one's hand. You're a cruel man, Jack Spada. Cruel is a matter of perspective. Is it? <laughs> <laughs> Save him? Part of the ship, part of the crew. The Dutchman must have a captain. Oh. Elizabeth, say goodbye. No! No! I won't leave you! Thank goodness, Jack. The Armada's still out there. The Endeavor's coming up hard to starboard. And I think it's time we embrace that oldest and noblest of pirate traditions. Never actually been one for tradition. In we go! Hmm. It's nothing personal, Jack. It's just good business.
It's just good business. Flying Dutchman must have a captain. Just where Danaushi and Captain Turner must live in different worlds. One day ashore, ten years at sea. It's a steep price. Well... Your chariot awaits, Your Highness. Mrs. Turner. I guess the boss. Take care. <laughs> Zack. Hmm. <laughs> Thank you. One day isn't enough time. Well, there's always enough time for hearts to say what's true. Sora, you know better than anyone. It only takes a moment to connect with your mates. With your hearties. Hmm. There's always enough time. And I'm going to find them. 